Hello everyone and welcome to a new video and today I'm going to show you how to play Fortnite on school Chromebook. It's very easy and simple, all you have to do is to follow my steps and before we begin, don't forget to hit the like button, subscribe and turn on the notifications. Now first thing you should do is to open your browser on your Chromebook and type Coursera.gq, then click on enter and it will show you this page right here all you have to do is to type what i'm gonna type right now and it will show on your screen right now then click on open in browser or open direct and it will move you into the cloud gaming web page then you should search for fortnite but first you should sign in by using your xbox account then click on fortnite and after signing in you will see that this option right here will be replaced by play button then click on play and it will show you a loading screen that may last from five minutes to an hour or more according to how many people are using cloud gaming to play fortnite on the same servers you are using now the second method is to go back into coursera and try to use cloud gaming by using geforce now you should type in the search bar what I typed right now and it will also show on your screen. Then click on open direct or open in browser. Then it will show you this page right here. All you have to do is to agree and continue. Then log in. And in order to use this method, you should download GeForce Now app. And you should also have a GeForce Now email in order to play any game that you want by using cloud gaming. So click on login, then it will ask you to log in with your email. And after logging in, all you have to do is to search for the game that you want to play. And in this case, it's Fortnite. Click on it and tap on play. And also this method may take some time till it loads on your Chromebook. So by these two methods, you can play Fortnite on your Chromebook. But the downside of these two methods that it may take a lot of time in some cases. So it may be time consuming. And that's all for today. I hope this video is useful to you all. Thanks for watching and see you in a new video.